But one word describes Amy to me, I would say the word would be significant. Collaboration. Exciting. Connected. Amy, in one word, means validation to me. It validates who I am, what I teach, where my students will go, that I am producing graduates that employers want, that I am impacting the future. So Amy definitely validates me. How has Amy made a difference in my career? That is just indescribable for me. It's, um, I was just a bench tech, never expected to do anything. Then I got involved in standards, and then I got on the TMC, and then I got on the board. And I've done more things and my, reached further and spread my wings further than I ever thought they would be. So it's done tremendous things for my career. Amy has enabled me to expand my career beyond my employer, help me get in touch and work with the field overall. Amy has made a huge difference in my career. As a matter of fact, I'm an OR nurse and I've been involved in sterile processing for the last 27 years, but when I first went there, I thought I knew everything there was about um, sterilization. But the staff kept saying, who's Amy? Or what would Amy say? You know, how would Amy say that? And I'm like, who's Amy? So I got involved with Amy um, about 15, 20 years ago. And um, it really has changed my world. So I know what the standards are. I help write the standards. I can go out there and actually practice and preach them. And I have to say, because of Amy, it has helped me to become an independent consultant. The way I envision healthcare technology in the next 10 years is exploding. I don't know what direction it's going to go. All I know is that it will go in many different directions because patient care and population health and all of the financial pressures on the healthcare organizations and all of the regulatory pressures on um, all aspects of the industry are going to drive so many changes. And then the, the technology evolution itself is going to just bring about so many more opportunities for this profession. I'm excited. I hope I'm around for a great number of those years. I'm actually researching that right now. I'm doing some work on that. And I know we are going to have to be very, very innovative as we move into the future. And I'm hoping that our field is able to do that and change and adapt. We're, we're going to have to change and adapt very fast. And we need to, we're a little behind but we need to start doing it faster and faster and faster because I think the world of healthcare is going to change very dramatically over the next couple of years and so we need to be on top of it. Technology, I think we'll see a continuation of the miniaturization of, of the technology, uh, personalization of technology. Um, technology is going to be moving more and more out of the hospital setting and into uh, clinics and, and patients' homes. Uh, people will be wearing technology. So I think that's how some of the technology will evolve in the, in the future years and we as a profession are going to have to adapt to support that type of changed technology. Mm -hmm.